Hi everyone, my name is Nashini Sri Ilopire and I am from MRSM Arau Police. Today, I am going to present about the theme Good Health and Well-Being. To be a well-being person, we should have good health. There are many types of health, but today I am going to share you three good healths, which are physical health, mental health, and social health. First of all is physical health. What is the meaning of physical health? Physical health is how well your body functions. Having enough energy to perform your daily activities and to deal with everyday stress. These are the activities to maintain physical health. You can exercise regularly and eat a healthy diet. Teenagers should take at least one hour of their time in a day to do some exercise to ensure their body health. Especially right now when everybody's at home, having online classes, everybody should take a break at, at least an hour to do some exercise. And also not to forget to have and healthy diet like eating more fruits and vegetables and drink more water than drinking fizzy drinks moving to the second part which is mental health what is mental health mental health is your feelings and your thoughts it's a reflection of how you feel about yourself and how you meet the demands on your daily life and also how you cope with the problems that occur in your life these are the activities you should do to maintain mental health. Firstly, you can talk about or express your feelings to someone regularly so that you would feel relieved in the inside and maybe set some realistic goals and aim to achieve them. The third health is called social health. What is social health? Social health means getting along with others. Social networks such as your family, your friends, and teachers. You don't have to have a lot of friends to have for social help. Having just a few special people whom you think you can share your feelings with are just enough. These are the activities to maintain social help. Firstly, you could hang out with the people you love or feel comfortable with. Secondly is get to know yourself better. Try identifying your interests and preferences and communicate them to the people around you. By knowing your true self, you will know the type of people who you would like to mingle with and this will engage you to a positive relationship with someone. Finally, we are going to know the consequences if good health is not maintained by someone. Firstly, a person could get obesity due to an unhealthy diet. Secondly, maybe that people could get diabetes due to having many sugary drinks. Or even maybe having cholesterol due to lack of physical activities. That's all from me and I hope everybody enjoyed my video. Bye-bye!